I think it's been critical for the development of Irish rugby, for club rugby. It, it provides a really good tournament for the senior clubs. And I think we've tweaked it a bit in the last few years, but I think this, that what we've got now is a, is a very, very good competition. And the, the clubs themselves enjoy playing it. I think secondly, the all Ireland League provides a, a spur and a goal for those clubs who perhaps haven't reached senior status, and many of them would love to do so. And I think that participating in the all Ireland League is a real goal for them. And the third, and, and maybe one of the most important areas is that players who perhaps have not made the step into professional rugby can still see that it's possible by playing at the higher levels of the all Ireland League that there is a step and a transition possible for ambitious players into the professional game. And it was best illustrated perhaps by the very first week of the Pro 12, when as many as six, seven or eight players who last year were playing Division 1A or 1B rugby football turned out as first choice for the professional uh, provincial sides and performed extraordinarily well. Brian, Brian Byrne obviously has been involved with Leinster for, for a number of years now and um, come through the league with, with Clontarf. Uh, we won it a couple of years ago. He was a, he was a key key member there and played the majority of games. So, um, look, it's great to, to to get a springboard for him personally. And obviously, having players of that quality involved with Clontarf, it obviously helps our aspirations um, in terms terms of league and competing for leagues. Um, Joey Carberry, pretty plain to see how how good he was last week. Um, and yeah, look, we were. Uh, very pleased with clearly um, with his contributions for us during the league last year, and ultimately through the through the knockout stages and into the final here. So great! Everyone in the club's delighted to see these lads do well. Yeah, I mean, over the last couple of years, it's been proven that the quality of player coming through is uh, of a very high standard, uh, particularly in 1A, where you're getting that level of intensity week in, week out. Uh, and thankfully, in our case, we've had a couple of players that have been pushing on the last year or two, and I suppose the most notable would be Dan Goggin, getting his first cap last week against uh, against Clatley and doing quite well. Uh, he's come through the academy system in the last, he's into his third and final year. Uh, and as I say, he's developed into Really good player now, I, I, you know, no problem playing at that level uh, as far as I'm concerned. Um, and again, just speaking to Money last week, you know, putting a lot of emphasis on his experience of playing AIL week in, week out against very high quality of player. Um, so yeah, it's definitely stood to him.